Aravis Lavage is a France-based company specializing in transportation and installation solutions for transformers, cable coils, and other equipment. To carry out their operations, they have a fleet of powerful MAN trucks, as well as specialized machines and equipment, some of which have been developed by themselves. One of their main activities is the transportation of coils in challenging areas, such as mountains, which requires a reliable truck like the MAN-33-422. This 6x6 unit has a load capacity of up to 35 tons, even on steep slopes. However, due to the difficulty of their work, the company has devised and manufactured a specially designed trailer to assist in these tasks. The trailer is equipped with a 1,000 horsepower engine that provides significant boost during ascents, this powerful combination of truck and trailer is capable of transporting loads of up to 100 tons, even on slopes of 45 degrees. Additionally, it features a stabilization system that keeps the coil in a favorable position, even on steep side slopes of up to 40%. One notable quality of this equipment is its excellent maneuverability. The rear axle of the trailer is steerable in 360 degrees and can be remotely controlled by an operator. This allows for precise maneuvers during loading and unloading, as well as in specific situations such as navigating through narrow spaces and extremely tight curves. Navistar is an American company specialized in the development of military trucks. Their vehicle lineup, based on the reliable international trucks, ranges from pickup trucks to heavy-duty trucks. These vehicles can be adapted to function as ambulances, patrol vehicles, or troop transports. One of their standout lines is the Max Pro, which can be configured as a 4x4 or 6x6 vehicle for heavy-duty tasks, such as cargo and personnel transport. These trucks are equipped with Cummins ISL engines, producing 450 horsepower and up to 1,630 newton meters of torque, providing excellent off-road capabilities. Among all their models, the Max Pro MRV stands out as it is designed for rescue and recovery operations. These vehicles feature a recovery boom that can lift up to 27 tons and has a 380 degree rotation. They are also equipped with winches for complex recovery tasks, capable of towing up to 22 tons without any issues. Additionally, their heavy-duty lift system can raise and tow vehicles weighing up to 16 tons on rough terrains. The Max Pro MRV is armored with highly resistant armor to withstand ballistic attacks, mine blasts, and improvised explosive devices, ensuring the safety of the crew against emerging threats during operations. This makes it one of the most exceptional rescue and recovery trucks in its class. During the 1970s and 1980s, weapon development was booming, and there was a demand for more efficient, versatile, and adaptable solutions for different situations. In this context, the United States Air Force commissioned a special project to the Mining Trucks and Special Equipment Division of Terex. The goal was to create a vehicle capable of transporting and launching an intercontinental ballistic missile MX, thus creating a mobile land-based launcher. To achieve this, 
Two Terex 3311C mining trucks were used, one in the front and one in the rear, allowing bi-directional movement without the need for maneuvering and ensuring efficient and powerful transportation. These mining trucks underwent significant structural modifications to support the weight of the missile and have the appropriate dimensions for safe transportation. The assembly measured over 50 meters in length, 6.6 .6 meters in width, and reached a height of 9 meters, with an astonishing weight of 660 tons. Additionally, leveraging the 1,000 horsepower engines of the trucks ensured the necessary power for movement. The project began to establish itself and conduct field tests in 1980. But just a year later, in 1981, the United States government decided to suspend the development program for this unit. The challenges and complications associated with its utilization made it a less viable option compared to other methods of launching the MX ICBMs. Nicholas Industry, a French company that is part of the TEI Group, specializes in the development and manufacturing of vehicles and equipment for heavy-duty transportation. Among its notable products is the Tractomus truck, designed to operate as a heavy-duty ballast tractor in oversized load transportation applications. The Tractomus is available in various configurations, ranging from 6x4 to 10x10, and is primarily used for moving electrical transformers and large loads. Companies like Rotran utilize convoys consisting of up to five Tractomus trucks to transport trailers with hundreds of tires and loads that can exceed 500 tons. These trucks are equipped with high-power Caterpillar engines to achieve optimal performance. Depending on the model, the engines can reach power outputs close to 1,000 horsepower and torques that exceed 3,500 newton meters. When working together, the Tractomus trucks can generate an impressive combined power of up to 4,700 horsepower and over 13,000 newton meters of torque. Despite their size and power, the Tractomus trucks feature Renault Carax truck cabins that provide comfort for the drivers. In 2015, the most robust model of these trucks achieved a Guinness World Record for being recognized as the largest road truck in the world, weighing over 70 tons. Rosenbauer, one of the world's leading manufacturers of firefighting and disaster control technology, is constantly dedicated to the development of new and innovative equipment for fire departments worldwide. These equipment are designed to operate in various conditions and environments, including those that are difficult to access for conventional units. One of Rosenbauer's standout products is the Tigon fire truck specifically designed for use in rugged or hard-to-reach terrain, such as mines, refineries, and oil fields. This vehicle leverages the reliability of a military-grade truck with exceptional features, such as the Tatra Force 8x8, which boasts a lightweight yet robust structure and an impressive load capacity. Equipped with a 690-horsepower Volvo engine, the Tigon ensures optimal performance at all times, even during pumping operations on the move. Its automatic transmission allows firefighters to focus on essential tasks without worrying about driving. In terms of firefighting capabilities, it is equipped with multiple water pumps that deliver flow rates ranging from 500 to 8,000 liters per minute at different pressures. It also features mixers that allow the combination of water with special foaming agents for enhanced firefighting effectiveness. Thank you so much for sticking around until the end of the video. We hope you enjoyed it and found it valuable. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel so you won't miss any of our upcoming videos.
We can't wait to see you in the next one.